With an increasing drive to reduce our reliance on fossil fuels, the automobile industry is going through the biggest evolution since the invention of the combustion engine. The transition to electric power. What's unusual is rather than traditional manufacturers paving the way, tech companies that are engineering impressive products are taking the lead in terms of innovations. One of these companies is Canu. They're taking a very different approach to the industry. And in this video, we're going to take a look at how they are rethinking electric vehicles. Who is Canu? Founded in 2017, Canu is a startup that's based in Torrance, California. Originally known as eVelocity, the people behind the company have a lot of experience in the industry, with one being a former executive at BMW and the other a former chief financial officer from Deutsche Bank. They've since put a team together that now numbers more than 300 people, each of whom has a background in either a leading tech or automotive company and are arguably the best placed group of people in the world to make Canoe's aspirations become a reality. With this wealth of experience that draws from the two main specialisms needed to create an electric vehicle, Canoe has developed a unique proposition that could revolutionize the way we think about vehicles. What differentiates Canoe from the competition? As is the case in many industries, automotive manufacturers have stuck to the traditional ownership model for decades. Customers usually buy a car outright and eventually look to trade up for a newer model. And even though higher purchases and rental agreements have become far more common in recent years, the focus is still on individuals having a car or truck of their own. Canoe is looking to change all of this. There will still be the option to purchase their vehicles outright, but they'll also be offering a membership plan that essentially works as a no-commitment lease where you'll receive a vehicle and be able to send it back once you have no further need for it. With this plan, the company will provide all insurance, maintenance and even charging that the vehicle needs, all for a monthly price. The modular system Of course, it's great that the company has a different approach to car ownership and the industry, but they need some great designs to make this worthwhile. Canoe realises that every customer has slightly different needs, which is one of the reasons why most car manufacturers have so many models on offer. This is extremely expensive to do, however, because of the costs involved in R&D and production. But Canoe has come up with a clever way around this. All of the vehicles the company is planning to offer are based on a generic platform, which can be altered in a modular fashion. Fitted as standard with a steer-by-wire system, the platform can be built with either 19-inch or 20-inch wheels, an all-wheel drive option with either one or two motors and a choice of battery capacity of up to 80 kilowatt hours. The battery packs are built directly into the structure of the platform to evenly spread the weight and to ensure a comfortable ride, it's built with a custom-designed composite leaf spring suspension system. Using the platform as the base across the entire line, manufacturing the rest of the vehicle is as simple as adding modular pieces. With a futuristic design concept, using curved edges and far more glass than traditional vehicles to let more light in. The idea is to maximize the amount of interior space as much as possible for an experience like no other. The Lifestyle Vehicle The first vehicle the company is bringing to market is called the Canoe Lifestyle Vehicle and the plan is for the first ones to be delivered to customers in 2022. Described as having the interior space of an SUV with the footprint of a smaller vehicle, the design of the interior cabin is certainly unique, with the traditional driver and passenger seat at the front, but bench-style seats in the back to make best use of all the space. The company is aiming this model at city explorers, businesses, families and adventurers. And despite being electric-powered, it'll easily live up to requirements. With a capacity of up to seven people, it has a range of 250 miles on a single charge. And even if the batteries are empty, it takes just 28 minutes to recharge them to 80%. It has an impressive top speed of 125 miles per hour, with the ability to accelerate from 0 to 60 in just 6.3 seconds. 
and features a state-of-the-art infotainment system that can be fully controlled by smart devices. You'll probably expect this to cost far more than a regular vehicle, but even the top-spec version of the lifestyle vehicle will only cost around $49,950. Other vehicles Because of the way the company has designed the core platform for the vehicles to be built upon, they're also planning to offer several other models very soon after the launch of the lifestyle vehicle. The multi-purpose delivery vehicle is, for example, aimed at business users who need to transport a moderate amount of cargo in the most cost-effective way and uses the floor space of the canoe platform to full advantage. Depending on the spec that's chosen by the customer, the MPDV can have between 230 and 500 cubic feet worth of storage space in total and up to a 300-mile range on full charge, all while still having the footprint of a small vehicle. The same too goes for the company's pickup truck, which is already taking pre-orders and is expected to launch in 2023. With a range of more than 200 miles, extra maneuverability is added to allow it to tackle more challenging terrain, and every inch of space has been used to its full potential. The truck has a six-foot-long bed that can be extended to eight feet and a roof rack above the cabin to provide further storage space. Quality of life features have been incorporated too, like perimeter lighting, a camper shell that's ideal for trips away, a retractable safe step that makes it easier to enter, and a fold-down craftsman bar where you can store all your tools and access the multi-accessory power plant to charge your equipment from the vehicle's batteries. Future designs while the company is planning to launch with three different vehicle types in the first few years, they point out that the future possibilities are endless. The unique way in which they've designed the main drive platform, upon which the vehicle chassis is installed, means that there's a very short lead time between designing a new chassis and being able to put it into production. As their manufacturing capability increases, they plan to offer a fully customizable service whereby you can choose the modules that will benefit you the most and can potentially have a vehicle to your precise spec within a matter of weeks. What makes this possible? As you can imagine, developing a vehicle like this is very costly in the development stage and the company has raised hundreds of millions of dollars so far. There have been attempts to work in collaboration with other manufacturers, with an initial agreement with Hyundai now having ended because of differing corporate plans, and rumors of an alignment with Apple on their Titan car project. Most recently though, Canoe merged with a special purpose acquisition company called Hennessy Capital Acquisition Corp IV and was listed on the Nasdaq Stock Exchange with a value of $2.4 billion. This allowed the company to raise a further $300 million to invest into its design and manufacturing capabilities and shows just how much interest there is in the sector that such huge sums can be raised before a single vehicle has left the production line. The Future of Canoe there's no doubt that since its formation in 2017, Canoe has recalibrated people's ideas of what the electrical vehicle market can become. There's still going to be a large number of people who want to be able to own their own vehicles outright, and this will be possible with Canoe's plan. But for those who live in congested areas or who only need to use a vehicle occasionally, the company's subscription model means they don't have to worry about the normal responsibilities of car ownership and can get on the road straight away. With the battery packs built within the base platform and the motors fixed within the axles of the car, every bit of space above the platform is available for the chassis design, and this means the cars look quite different than what we're used to. They are arguably some of the most futuristic designs that are in production and will be sure to turn heads wherever you go. One of the real concerns of electric vehicles is their range and how easy it is to recharge them. But the technology that underpins the Canoe platform is an industry leader and shows that electric vehicles will soon be more than feasible at a reasonable price point. Not only will you be able to have a car that's packed full of technology, but it'll be much better for the environment too. The modular design of the Canoe vehicles is also an industry changer because traditionally you have to choose a model that best suits your needs, even if not everything about it is perfect for what you want. Just imagine being able to customize every piece of your new ride, from the interior configuration 
to the amount of space for storage, to the types of lights, glass and overall shape of the chassis. Conclusion There's no doubt that electric vehicles are the future of the automotive industry. Countries across the world have already set dates within a decade whereby it will be illegal to sell cars with combustion engines. So the whole industry is in a race to develop their own designs. Tech companies have, however, proved themselves to be more innovative and nimble when it comes to creating new ideas. And instead of sticking to the traditional business models, they're able to completely rewrite the book on how things are done. Canoe is perfectly placed to make headway in the industry. And while they won't be the first startup to sell electric vehicles, they're targeting customers that haven't yet been given many choices for a totally green, no emission vehicle. If the company keeps to its plans and is truly able to produce cars to the specs that they claim, then it won't be long until you see canoes driving on streets near you. We hope you've enjoyed today's video. Don't forget to subscribe to Most Extreme and click the bell so you'll get notified of our new videos. Thanks for watching.